So real quick, we're going to take a look at this uh, generator field control circuit. I have a basic power hooked up to the uh, ECU. I have uh, the control for the alternator. It's on this blue wire here. I have a little LED set up to show when it's on and off. And I also have a little motor here. That's just to draw some extra amps. Um, you can use a lamp too. And in this case, I uh, like the motor. It don't hurt my eyes quite as bad as the bright lights. Uh, here I have a scanner hooked up. It's going to show us what voltage our computer has seen. It's going to show us what target charging voltage it, it wants before it comes on, which is 14.02. And then this will show the duty cycle of the you know alternator. That's my power supply, so I'll control the voltage with that. And then we can watch the duty cycle on the oscilloscope here. Um, so I'm going to turn it, start turning it down. And we heard the motor come on. We see our duty cycle there. That's on the input side of the uh, you know the switch for the generator. So that that's the logic side. And we see our light on, we hear a little motor going, and we're only at 30% duty cycle. But if we come down even further, we see our duty cycle getting bigger there. And now it's pretty much 100%. Yeah, there we go, 100%. So we're, we're pretty low voltage on our car right now, and the alternator is running full time. Uh, we can come back a little bit. Uh, we're at 14 volts now. We see our duty cycle starting to back off a little bit. Battery's charging up. And the battery's charged. We are above our target charging voltage. So everything is now off.